All right, here we are, part four, Walter Hollowell's garage with his Triumph TR6 uh, engine rebuilt. Now we have the connecting rods onto my forged pistons, and I have the piston rings installed, and ring number two has a top and a bottom, so make sure you get that right. And make sure you get the gap where it should be. Just follow your manual, it'll tell you. I've already coated the cylinder wall with oil. I'm going to put a little oil around the piston, make sure it gets into the grooves where the piston rings go. Then I'll put my put it in my compressor. Get it good and snug. You see that my new connecting rod bearings are in place. And the uh, Connecting rod journal on the crankshaft is lubricated as well. Make sure I have it orientated front or back. This goes front. Place it in. It's something to force it down. Okay, now it's now it's above the crankshaft. So I'll rotate this stand 90 degrees to where I can reach and put my main bearing caps on, which I've already greased uh, with the ARP bolts and the ARP grease. Just follow the instructions on that. So the high compression pistons are in place. It's stack to zero. I'll show you that later. But this is the end of part four of our engine rebuild. See you soon.